In this video, we'll balance the equation for iron plus iodine yields iron 3 iodide. Let's count the atoms up on both sides of the equation. We have one iron and then two iodine atoms. On the product side of the equation, one iron and then three iodide atoms. Whenever I have an odd number of atoms, I like to get that to an even number because that'll make it much easier to balance these iodines over here. So let's multiply the FeI3 by a coefficient of 2. This 2 applies to everything here. So we have 3 times 2. That gives us 6 iodines. And then 1 times 2. That gives us 2 iron atoms. This is nice, though, because now that this is 6, I can see a coefficient of 3. 2 times 3. That'll give me 6. And now the iodine atoms, those are balanced. To fix the iron, I have 2 here and 1 here. Put a coefficient of 2 in front. 1 times the 2. That gives me 2. And those are balanced. So when you have an odd number, like we had three iodine atoms here, if you multiply it by two, get it to an even number, that often makes the balancing a lot easier. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Fe plus I2 yields FeI3. Thanks for watching.